Hello, BookTube. This Howdy. is Kelly with Books I'm Not Reading. I have a special guest today. Howdy, readers. Jason from Chapter and Verse. So, Jason does not know about Mad Libs. And I just thought it would be really funny to do a Mad Libs that's themed around BookTube. But if it's not funny, I'm not going to show this. So if you're watching this, things turn out well. <laughs> but we'll just see how it goes. So Jason, I'm going to ask Jason for um, some words. And then I will read the Mad Lib story. But his words need to be at least partially BookTube related. Book like so, celebrity has to be a celebrity on BookTube. That kind of thing. Okay? I think we all know where that's going. <laughs> all right. So, um, Jason, the first word I need from you is a title of distinction. Oh, a title of distinction. Um, Just... uh, the ruler of books. Okay. All right. Um, an adjective that's a superlative. <sighs> um, parts of speech, parts of speech. Um, <laughs> Do you want a definition? Uh, no, I know adjectives. Um, of I so, an adjective that is a superlative. Okay. Um, all right. And it has to be book to be. Okay. Um, well, th this, I mean, you know. Okay. All right. Fantastic. Right. <laughs> <coughs> um, let's see. Uh, body part. Body part. Um... Brain. Brain. Okay. Um, adjective. All right, another adjective. But non-superlative? Just a regular one? Just a regular adjective. Okay. Um, oh, let's say, uh, musty. Yeah. <laughs> okay. We have like a cat over here, too. Okay. All right. Uh, another adjective. <coughs> um Oh oh um <gasps> Flower covery Flower covery is that like a nod to Memento Mori yes, or something Yes yes I was thinking of his video and his disdain for a certain kind of reasonable okay. cover Adverb <coughs> an adverb. Now, now, this is the part of speech. So, this is an ly word. It's like an adjective for a verb. Yeah. Okay. And then so, like, like thinly. Is that no? That's not what I want to choose. But that's right. So, I'm along. With, I'm along the right lines here. Um, okay, an adverb. Uh, um, this is hard to do on the spot. Hold on. I know. That's the point. Okay, the point well, is this is why just... I'm never on Jimmy Fallon's show. This is not about Jimmy Fallon. <laughs> All right. Um, an adverb. Uh, Ad okay. Yes. All right. Um, uh, slowly. The way it's the way I read. Okay. Nationality. Oh, nationality. Um, Canadian. All right, um, a celebrity. Steve Donahue. We knew that was coming some yeah. point, right? Yeah. Okay, another celebrity, so different. Okay, different celebrity. <coughs> um, a different celebrity. Uh, I would say, uh, let's say Neil Griffiths. Okay. And then, um, so, uh, n another, just the name of another person, so maybe not like a famous booktuber, but, like, uh, okay, um, or just another, let's, let's say, uh, Jasmine from Jasmine's Reads. Okay. All right, and adjective. All right, and another adjective, um. Let's see. <laughs> uh, uh, all right, another adjective. All right, one second. I'm just trying to think of like a good one. 
Um, <coughs> I keep wanting to invent words, though, in my head. I'm so glad um, I'm not the one who is overthinking in this moment. Okay, let's say, let's say amphetamine No, no, no. That's not a word. And you get mad when other people use words that aren't I make words. up words all the time in poetry. <sighs> no, that's okay. not going to work here. All right, no amphetamine um, and we're not talking about those kind of booktubers anyway. Um, <coughs> um, um, oh, oh, uh, Chunky. Yes. Chunky? Yes, Chunky. That's what we just, that's how we, do people on booktube describe. Okay, okay, all right, that's it. Okay, so, Jason, so now that you've given me these words, I filled them into <coughs> a story, a Mad Lib story. I, I hope you guys are familiar with this. I, it's, it's actually a really good way for kids to learn, like, yeah, what different kinds of words are. And because that's what I am. I'm a kid learning what adverbs well, are. Well, you are the one with a master's degree in English, and yet you were, like, struggling to... Well, no, so this, before so. we move on... So this is because, so I don't know these things. That's like, I know how to use them, but I don't know what they're called. And I think it's because I watched a lot of, uh, what was it, uh, the, the, the Schoolhouse Rock when I was a kid. My mom said I was obsessed with this show, and I think I like just imbibed all this stuff when I was a kid. And so when I got to school, like, I just knew it. And, no, seriously. Like, I don't remember ever learning what adjectives were in school or adverbs. Like, I just knew how to Did use language. Did you ever diagram sentences? Um, Anybody out there diagram sentences? Am I dating myself here? Or, like... I, you, I went to school in the country. Did you, did you ever diagram sentences? <coughs> oh, I think I have for fun, but I don't remember ever doing for it. For fun? I don't think, no, I, don't think I, ever, I don't think I remember ever what doing it. What should I do on this Saturday afternoon? I don't think I remember doing Cut it in a classroom. Diagram senses. All right. Okay. So everyone, I know you. We were anxiously waiting to hear the story Bye. of Elizabeth the first. Oh, cool! I like that. The book two version of yes. Elizabeth first. Yeah. Elizabeth, the Tudor. Ruler of Books of England was probably the fantastic ruler <laughs> the British ever had. But it didn't quite work out there. But Elizabeth was the daughter of Henry VIII and Anne Boleyn. Later, Anne had, I'm sorry, Anne had her brain chopped off by Henry. <laughs> Elizabeth was born. She's not the daughter of Anne Boleyn. Elizabeth, Is that what it says? Elizabeth the first? Yeah. Yeah, it says she's the daughter of Henry the Eighth and Anne Boleyn. <laughs> oh, she is the daughter of Anne Boleyn. <laughs> Says the man who loves Wolf Paul. Okay. All right. All no, right. no. All right. I'm. I. Are we on the same page? Yes, Can we're I on the same ahead? page. Okay. All right. Who the hell is? Don't okay. worry about that. Like, think about that. <coughs> right. Elizabeth was born in 1533 and became queen when she was 25. She was a musty Protestant <laughs> and persecuted <coughs> the flower covery Catholics slowly. <laughs> in 1588, the Canadian Armada attacked England <coughs> when the English fleet Commanded by Steve Donahue <laughs> and Neil Griffith threatened them. Elizabeth ruled for 45 years, and during her reign, England prospered and produced Shakespeare, Francis Bacon, and Jasmine of Jasmine Three. <laughs> <laughs> Elizabeth never married, which is sometimes... <laughs> what? Elizabeth never Never marry, and you you eat a lot of chocolate. <laughs> the 
chunky queen will never look and and Jason got a history lesson as well. <laughs> hey, that I was I was clearly confused. But uh, you have to admit, if you saw <coughs> Steve Donahue and Neil Griffiths commanding an army uh, or an armada, that would be pretty terrifying. Well, Neil would be tried as a traitor. <laughs> he would so, be. He would be. I love that Jasmine that I <laughs> accidentally got her nationality correct. She is in the the proper company. <sighs> she is in the Mad Lib. All so. right. Anyway. All right. Thanks, guys. Have a good, have a good weekend. All right. Bye.